I just arrived to Port Crescent State Park campground and lady in the front office won't let me in because it's 12.55 and she said I'll let you in at 1 o'clock sharp what the hell but anyway I have to wait not very friendly lady not very friendly stuff today I have no choice I have to wait so finally they let me in it's a one story right now so I was waiting for about 40 minutes and they said my site was busy but actually I checked it wasn't they just it's just principle uh, a sense just not very nice people working at front office today but anyway I'm here here's my site and it's a lake view it's hard to see lake because it's over the hill I think you can see it, right? yeah so it's a good spot I'm gonna spend here a couple days it's gonna be lots of activities I hope so we'll see So okay, this is Port Crescent Campground, Michigan. It's a Saginaw Bay, right there. I'm gonna walk you right now and show you what it looks like. I'm gonna spend here a couple days. I, I could use my uh, kayak because it's too windy and waves too high. You, you're gonna see in a minute. But anyway, I um, here's a sleeper campground, maybe 10, 15 miles from here. If I'm gonna collect some wild mushrooms, I will cook it. And I will do rotisserie chicken this time for dinner. Alright, let me walk you to the lake. So far so good, looks good. Oh yes, lots of wave. It's windy. But people swimming. People swimming. Very nice sandy beach. And water should be warm too. I will try tomorrow or even today. Oh, here is some pond. Oh well. So, anyway, it's a very nice area. Oh, here are some people too. So campsite along all the shore, everywhere, it's about probably 20 sides by the lake, lake view. Might kind of partial lake view, but that's okay. Very nice. So how you could see it, it's a very nice area, especially in the summer when it's hot warm day and it's awesome sandy beach. Please come here and enjoy it. But right now I'm heading to west. West from here, it's a uh, Albert Super State Park, and I hope I'm gonna get some mushrooms. So finally arrived in the Slipper Albert Slipper Slipper State Park and Lake, well actually Saginaw Bay behind me, and I'm going to that direction to get some mushrooms. 
I hope. Forest very dry and couple days ago it was kind of cool weather, no rain. So I found no mushrooms, well no edible mushrooms. I found couple poisoning mushrooms, not edible mushrooms. I, I guess I have to wait for a couple more weeks to get some mushrooms. So going back to home, back to camping. This is Slipper State Park Campground Beach. Very nice. Sandy. Shallow water. Excellent place to spend the day.
Finally, it's almost dinner time. So today for dinner, rotisserie chicken. Chicken, spices, it's called chicken. <laughs> yeah, well, you can use any spices, just, mm, smells good. So, let's start it. Some olive oil. Oops handful first before we eat it we're gonna give a, a massage Swedish massage relaxation today is very windy day well actually tomorrow was too Next step, to wrap up in the foil. So let's wait for about 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, I will put in the rotisserie and uh, open fire, campfire, I'm gonna get ready, it's right there, and my fire pit. Let's cleanse this place. I don't want to send my chicken. And I think my fire is ready. Let's check it. Here's going to be my rotisserie. This level. Mississippi 1, Mississippi 2, Mississippi 3. Good temperature. Here's my chicken. Here's my rotisserie tool. I hope I can stick it through. Yeah. Okay. Now my motor. goes inside motor okay let's turn it on all right working Success! <laughs> While my rotisserie chicken getting ready, I am going to fry potatoes to do my my grill. Fry potatoes. Okay, 
Now it will be very hard process because I need to unwrap chicken hen. Anyway, and continue frying process. So turn it open, motor, then Let's process to continue till it's full ready. Now let's see a close look. Yeah, this looks good. What about our potatoes on the grill? Oh yeah, almost ready. I would say it's ready. I'm going to just relocate on my fire. Just let it keep it warm. Hot, hot, hot. Ooh. I think it's fine. Good. Everything is ready and ready to serve. But I need to be very careful. It's very, very hot. Very hot. Now guys, tell me, what restaurant you know could serve this kind of food? Cheers, my friend. Oh, wow, wow, hot, hot, hot. Mm. I have another surprise for me. It's a baked potato. Oh. Now I remember my childhood when I was a kid. <coughs> you grab some potato and throw in the fire. This is very 
Пандинов.